They may be on the road, but the Bulls still know how to dress to impress. A look here as they come off the bus earlier today. The Staples Center downtown Los Angeles and the freeways of L.A. All painting the picture just where we are tonight. Welcome, everybody, to the day we've all been looking forward to. The start of a new NBA season on 2K Sports. Kevin Harlan here along with analysts Greg Anthony and Steve Smith. And we'll be hearing from D.A. along the sideline all game long. A chance to check out Los Angeles' upcoming schedule on Sunday. They'll be matching up against Kevin Durant and the Brooklyn Nets. And then on Wednesday, they'll be matching up with Chris Paul and the Phoenix Suns. And before we get going, let's hear from David Aldridge John on the sideline. David? Good evening to you, Kevin. Patrick Williams was a five-star. Yeah, I love his game. That was a good report. Thank you. And for those teams that suffered a harsh ending to last season, Greg, what are they feeling here on opening night? I mean, motivated. You, you think about that kind of thing all summer, and the chance for retribution starts now. Now let's take a look at the Bulls' opening lineup. In the backcourt, it's Ball and Levine. Williams is out there with Vucevic, and it's DeRozan in at the three spot. And for the Lakers. And they have their big three all out there. Westbrook at the point with LeBron and Davis at the forward. Marcus Saul is out there with Monk. Now here's Westbrook. Davis in the corner for three. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Outside, ball. Beyond the arc. Gasol with the rebound. And so Gasol will bring it up for the Lakers. Steve, you look at the resume for Mark Gasol. Three-time All-Star, Defensive Player of the Year, NBA Champion with Toronto, and Gold Medalist with Spain. Kevin, not bad for the 48th pick back in 2007. An incredible career. And even when his plan days are done, in my opinion, we know he'll continue to make a difference. Lakers shooting their first free throws of the night. And the first one at the line is good. The durability and endurance of LeBron at this point in his career is astonishing. And both free throws good for LeBron. And the Bulls with possession. Ball surveying the defense. Levine passes to Williams, and it's Williams with the jam. Instinctual pass by Zach Levine doesn't hesitate to feed the wide open man. Westbrook with it. Williams picks him up. The kick out to Westbrook. Off target from outside. Now, here's Ball. Hunt defending. Ball with the bucket. You don't need to get all the way to the rim if you have the floater game. Ball showing the versatility. Westbrook passes to James. Outside for Gasol. On the wing, Monk. Six on the shot clock. Off to a good start as he gets his first shot attempt. And one of the more underrated elements of his game. I mean, this is a guy that's always in control. Love seeing him finish even with the contact. Now here's DeRozan. Takes it from 10. And too long on the shot. On the wing, Monk. Guarded by Levine. For Chicago, they've gone two for four from the field so far today. Good D by James. This is the shot you want right at the rim. He just couldn't deliver. The shot's good from Westbrook. Westbrook. And I think the contact helps Westbrook. I mean, so competitive. This guy invites that bump. Down low, here's Vucevic. That falls. Nice feed that time from Ball. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now here's Westbrook. Gasol kicks to Westbrook. 
Now, here's Monk. Defense is right there. Gasol dishes to Westbrook. Here's Davis. Laid in with a nice touch off the glass. You see the weight that AD's added to his frame over the years. Now invites contact. Passes it to Levine. Let's it go with a three. Buries it from three-point range. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. And so Westbrook will bring it up for the Lakers. They trail by one. Pass to Davis. Over Williams. That shot, no good. And the Bulls going the other way now. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Levine up top. Monk defending. Levine gets the bucket. Levine. Man, he has come out focused and efficient. Love what he's doing at the offensive end. And the pass to Monk. Back to Westbrook. This is a Monk. Nail from three-point land. Monk's got five now. And Monk's just got a good feel about kind of how to exploit the defense, especially about how quickly he gets his shot off after getting the pass. Tie game in Los Angeles. And we'll be back in just a moment with the start of the second quarter. And now, a chance to hear LeBron James expound on the difference between offense and defense more delicate than defense. Defense, you can make mistakes but cover for one another by just communicating and flying around at times and clean up for your mistakes. Offensively, if you're not all five guys at the same time or not. You know, Greg, I could listen to him talk basketball all day. And he makes a valid point. You can't just hustle your way to great offense. It takes time and chemistry. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even so far on the scoreboard. And taking a look at the Lakers' performance here, what have they been doing or not doing in the game? Attacking, drawing fouls. They won that first quarter at the line. Some people might feel they got some hometown calls, but when your team is pushing the action, you often get the benefit of the doubt. So with Vucevic on the bench, here's the group that Billy Donovan has on the floor. Derek Jones is out there with Troy Brown. Then it's White. Then there's Bradley. And it's Caruso in at the one. Okay, well, let's go down to David Aldridge for a report from the sideline. Thank you, Kevin. Anthony Davis, of course, is a superstar at both ends of the court. LeBron James says his ability to guard anybody on the floor, one to five, take the challenge to guard on the perimeter, and continue to protect the paint. It's hard to score on him. Guys, DA, he is a lead in every way. Thank you. That free throw missing. What an incredible run for the 2020 Lakers in the bubble. Of course, LeBron and AD got the headlines, but Rajon Rondo was also key. We saw GA playoff Rondo at his peak. He had 107 assists in the playoffs, the most for a player off the bench in almost 50 years. And how about the incredible timing on that alley -oop. He absolutely hammered it down. Rondo passes to a reason. Now here's Rondo. He's guarding closely. From down in the low post, it goes. And the strength of Rondo finishing through contact. Here's Caruso. He's covered by Rondo. Caruso, no good. Here's Los Angeles now. Their next game playing at home as the Nets come into town. And that game is the second of two straight at home. Outside Rondo. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with a foul. Hey, you know a thing or two about being a floor general. It's no longer just a traditional guard role. Not at all. No. They're point forwards, even point centers. An offense doesn't have to run through the backcourt anymore. You look at guys like LeBron and, and Jokic, it's a different game. Kendrick Nunn, he's jacked in for Trevor Ariza. You know, Rondo takes great pleasure at slicing and dicing up the defense. One of the best passers in the game. What a play there. The hoop plus the arm. That's his first. LeBron, he's checked in for Rajon Rondo. Vucevic checked in for the Bulls. 
DeMar DeRozan comes in for Alex Caruso. And Kobe White in the open floor is a blur. Great burst with the ball. He can fly right by his defenders. He knows when to turn the Jets on, G.A. Very big part of his offensive production. Chicago leading. Brown feeling out of it. White inside, working on Howard. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. Three and while we have a moment, let's check the stats for DeRozan. Last season, he played outstanding. 11th in assists, and he'd make you pay every time he went to the line. Top 20 in free throw percent. And he was the consummate playmaker last season. Completely unselfish. Always had his head up, looking for the open man. Looking at who's out there now for the Lakers. Davis comes in for Dwight Howard. And Russell Westbrook subbed in for Ken Baseball. Yes, sir. Ball kicks to Levine. That falls. Nice that feed that time Levine. from Ball. Levine's got his third basket of the night. We'll see if they can finally hold on to a lead. It's been back and forth all night. Both teams putting forth their best efforts right now. This is the kind of game fans pay to see. Trying to get open as Davis gets it to go. That one good from Nunn. Nunn's got his first bucket in this one. The Bulls have gone four of seven from the field in this second quarter so far. Pass to Vucevic. Mar DeRozan on the wing. Outside ball. No good on the triple. And the rebound battle split evenly thus far. LeBron passes to Davis. Bucket is good. And now it's a three-point Los Angeles lead. Oh, he's heating up here now in the second quarter. Watch out. And uh, almost four minutes gone here in the second quarter of play. Ball against none. Ball kicks to DeRozan. Back to Ball. the wing unable to get that one decent look for mid-range but there may have been a better option for them in that set and that's it for the first half of action what's been a very close game here Lakers on top up by three thanks very much here thank you David and we'll be back for the third quarter of action following halftime and now the 2k sports halftime show A competitive matchup for the Lakers in the first quarter. Their field goal percentage was a robust 50% in the period. That's something they can hang their hat on. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. You look at Zach Levine, he's really been playing well. Yeah, and just look at the numbers from the first half. He has been very efficient. And it's not like everything's been at the rim. There's been a number of jump shots along the way. And they have their big three all out there. Westbrook at the point with LeBron and Davis at the forward. Malik Bunk out there with Mark Gasol. That's the Laker five. And that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. A fantastic mobile one block. This one deserves another look. And that is a huge block. Given how close this game is, a stop like that was right on point. Ball finds Levine. Six to shoot. And a miss there on the triple. Lakers leading by three. Here's Westbrook. And there's Davis. That's good on the assist from Westbrook. Westbrook's got his fourth assist in this one. One of the big surprises with the NBA draft, the trade of Russell Westbrook. Westbrook let it be known he was open to another move. And it will be interesting to see how he fits next to LeBron and AD this season. 
Now when Lonzo Ball entered the league in 2017, Greg, there were major questions about his shooting. And he struggled, of course, during his rookie year. Yeah, and, and shooting 30% from deep and under 50% at the line. But credit to Lonzo. He's put major work into his stroke, getting that free throw percentage to over 75% during his fourth year in the league. And his three-point numbers, they've the also game. improved greatly. And in the history of the game, few players LeBron's size have handled the ball as well as he does. Outside, Levine. Ball against Westbrook. Shoots. Misses off the left eye. Empty possession, and you don't want to miss these easy looks. And James throws it down. Explosive drive by James, knifing up the defense and getting to his shot. And the first time out of the game called for Chicago. And now in the second half of his career, Russell Westbrook wants to breathe. He knows he's getting older and has no time to waste. It's why he plays with such passion. And some changes here for the Lakers. Dwight Howard, he's checked in for Gasol. Lisa comes in for James. Arjan Rondo is subbed in for Russell Westbrook. So Chicago going with an almost entirely new group. Bradley's checked in for Vucevic. Jones comes in for Williams. Kobe White, he's checked in for Levine. And it's Alex Caruso in for ball. Punk for three. And it's Bradley with the rebound. And Westbrook's high motor is why we love him. He goes out breaking competes every play in every game. No doubt, but I tell you what, he's tired of missing out on the NBA Finals. This is a guy that is hungry to get back to that stage. Interesting to see if he can get it done. And becoming more physical over the years. DeRozan converts off contact extremely well. We all know he's a tremendous athlete. He's added a lot of strength. He adjusts well in the air, and he can finish with either hand. Hard to stop him once he's in the lane. Loads it up for Davis. And that's 10 straight points in the paint. The defense, nowhere to be found. 144 and left in the third. DeRozan against Ariza. Now, here's DeRozan. Guarded close. Tony Bradley. And Bradley gets it to go. Coming off the pick, DeRozan oh, commands a lot of attention. That creates room to hit the roller. Rondo scanning the floor to the middle. A nice shot by Howard. Howard's got the lead back up to six now for Los Angeles. And it's coming easy for them right now. Five baskets in a row in the paint. Here's Bradley. And he lays it straight in. Bradley's got four points this quarter. Kobe White keeping his head up shows great vision and delivers a great pass. So timeout called here. The first for Los Angeles. And Kobe White, you hate to see him settle. He's best when going at the rim. The defense wins if he takes that mid-range jumper. Looking at who's out there now for the Lakers. Carmelo Anthony has checked in for Howard. Ken Bazemore comes in for Trevor Ariza. And it's Kendrick Nunn in for Malik Monk. Then for the Bulls, Vucevic comes in for Tony Bradley. And it's Brown in for Jones. Here's Caruso. He's covered by Bazemore. Vucevic dishes to White. Just five on the clock. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. You know, in a seven-footer that can play the entire court, Lucevic is a tough cover because of that versatility. Nikola Lucevic, two shots. And both free throws good for Vucevic. Because he knows he makes a living at the line, he invites contact and sometimes even initiates it. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. None passes to Rondo. Baysmore on the wing. And it's good coming on the assist by Rajon Rondo. Rondo's got three assists in the game. Caruso looking for an opening. Trying to find Davis. He's got it now. Up in time. 
No good on that one. And so it's Los Angeles bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. Their shooting has been the big key. Their percentage from the field so far has been terrific. And here now a chance to show you our assist of the game. And it's presented as always by State Farm. It's just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? Execution. This is what you practice every day. These guys are professionals. Beautiful play. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. Okay, now let's reset our lineups courtesy of Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go for this fourth quarter. Taking a look at the Bulls. Brighton Levine on the wing. Vucevic is out there with Williams. And it's Ball in at the point guard. James, no good. Bulls trail by seven. And James pulls it down. James has got four rebounds in this game. Here's Anthony. Lays it up off the glass. Anthony's got his first basket of the night. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. To the wing right side. Paul with a wide open look. Hits the three-point bomb. Alonzo has been working on that. Shooting off the catch with confidence and without hesitation. White against Westbrook. At the elbow, it's Gasol. Knocked away. It's stolen by Vucevic. Outside, ball. To the inside. There's Williams. That falls. Nice feed that time from Ball. The assist from Ball's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. LeBron against Levine. LeBron passes to Gasol. Good. Nice job down low. And the Lakers lead by six. LeBron, the defender was all over Mark Gasol. He just has that type of creativity to find a little space and knock it down. There's Ball with the three. A rebound by the Lakers. James has got his fifth rebound in this one. Anthony kicks to LeBron. That one doesn't go. Excellent D there from Williams. And so it's Ball who brings the ball up for the Bulls. Pass to Vucevic. The three. Knocks down the three ball. Look at that shot. Vucevic not afraid to carry the weight, so to speak. And in a tough situation, the team knows they can rely on him. Los Angeles calls timeout. They're ahead by three. 146 left in the fourth quarter. And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game. 